When I went through the research on autism, I am not being hyperbolic. It is the most crazy thing I've seen in my life. We say as a profession so emphatically that vaccines don't cause autism. It's proven. It's proven. It's not proven. It's not even close. There isn't research on autism and all the other vaccines. Not on Hep B, not on pneumococcus, not on chickenpox, not on whooping cough, not on all the other vaccines. So we don't actually know. It's one in every 36 children. You know what it is in California? What is it? One in 22. And I guarantee you that 99.9% of doctors don't actually know what the literature says. Chronic diseases and autism both are definitely going up. Our food, I mean, air quotes food, a lot of it isn't really food anymore. They're spraying it with all sorts of stuff. I mean, we talk about organic, but that just means that they're not spraying it with pesticides. We're surprised that our kids are sick and that 50% or more of our kids have a chronic disease when they're not getting nutrients, they're not eating real food. All these people that were intelligent about addiction and making you addicted to these things, now they're in food companies. What you cannot say is that they, that they the science is settled, that they don't cause it. You don't know that. You don't know what causes it because you'd have to do the studies to prove or disprove that. What I do know based on looking at the research is we don't know for sure and we should be doing a lot more research. They've got their tentacles in everything and we don't even know how much of an influence they're having on us.